guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, I'm Megan of Curves, Curls, and Clothes, and I'm really trying to get into more of these styling videos for you guys, and I want you to be able to go in your closet, pick out looks yourself, and feel confident putting a look together, and then walking out the door in it, and feeling good about your outfit, and your styling, and all of that. So, I'm going to show you a few really, really great in the summer looks today. There's three looks in here that you, they're not all from one brand. There are pieces that I picked up here and there. And I'm really gonna get into clothes in general and putting together outfits so that you can run out to whatever is close to you if you do not have access to some of the places and brands that I talk about. You can recreate these looks by buying similar pieces and putting them together yourself. So today is video, three bomb looks you can wear for the end of the summer. Cause we are getting into August and um, very, very soon. And then we'll be, transitioning out of pastels and whites and things like that. So I wanna show you these three bomb looks that I put together for your last few weeks of summer and I think there's some really, really good looks in here and they're all in the same like dusty rose and like blush and powder blue. They're all in that family of color. So I just really, really liked the whole vibe of all three of these looks. So I'm going to jump right into these and show you guys what I put together. So the first look is this pencil skirt here. So it is a floral pencil skirt and it has the blue and white stripe and then it has this floral pattern over the top that has a lot of different mauves and just different um, shades of pink and that is this whole collection we're gonna call it so I got this from fashion to figure and I had ordered like a white tank to go with it and when I put it on I just wasn't feeling the look I don't know why I just didn't like the white with it and I remembered that I had this little blue tank that I think I picked up at like Target or something in this powder blue color here so it is not the exact same color as blue as in this but it's in the same family and i really liked the look of it together so you could totally stop there and that would be a good look but because it's got to be a look i added this light wash denim ja oversized jacket and I wore it off the shoulder. So you could wear this regularly on the shoulder. You could wear it off both shoulders because it is summertime, it is hot. But I just wore it off the shoulder and this is a really lightweight denim and it's a light wash and it's just a really good combination to dress down this look. So this, a pencil skirt automatically screams a little dressier, but, and then the tank and the denim dress it down so you can wear it casual you can wear it every day or you could wear it to the office either one whichever one you wanted to do so this jacket is from fashion nova and i just love their oversized jackets they fit well in the arms because i carry a lot of weight in my arms so they fit well in the arms and i never have any trouble with the fit so with that first look i paired it with just some basic nude heels. These are some wedges, cork wedges, and I just really wanted something that was going to be subtle and not take away because the skirt is a floral print and a stripe together. So I didn't want anything loud. I didn't want anything that was gonna draw attention because I wanted the skirt to be the statement piece of that look. So I just wore it with these I think I've had these for forever. Um, I'm not really even sure where I got them, but any nude wedge would do just fine. So that is the first look. Next up, we have a peplum shirt. So a peplum is always great because it's just a really good cut for almost anyone and any body type. And this one is really cute because it has ties at the straps, ties at the shoulders. <laughs> So this has, and they are adjustable, so you can customize to whatever you need for their length. As you can see, this one had come untied, so I'm gonna tie that back. And it has some smocking in the back, which is very nice because it makes it super comfortable and easy to wear, super stretchy. This is crazy lightweight and airy and just really, really comfortable. It has a blue and white stripe pattern on it. And instead of wearing this with like just regular jeans, I decided to opt in for some white jeans. So 
it brought out the white stripe in the pants and it's just a really clean crisp look for these end of summer months white with this light blue i just think it's a really good combo especially heading into the hottest month so it's just a really easy look to pair and if you had a um blue shirt at home it wouldn't have to be this one necessarily and some white jeans put that combo together and you are good to go so again i decided to go with a nude heel for these for these i did um a strappier heel with a block heel and i think i got these from fashion nova i want to say um but these are just i wanted something the pants are a bit of a crop pant there are they're a petite cut so they don't go super long and i wanted something that was going to come up on the ankle for this look and i just wanted to give myself a little height y'all know i'm short i'm 5'3 so these are a little bit of a higher heel with a peplum being going out and giving you that that width around the middle i wanted something that made my legs look a little longer so that's why i opted for a higher heel so the last look is this so pretty this uh, off the shoulder another peplum <laughs> off the shoulder shirt that is long sleeve and this is from pretty little thing this is a size us 18. So, so with a peplum cut, you would automatically think a little dressier, but I flipped the script on this one and paired it with some light wash denim distressed shorts. So I wear, I wore these because I wanted this to be a casual everyday look. This is a long sleeve shirt, but to wear it in the summertime, you can wear it, pair it with shorts and it gives you that balance. So, and you're not gonna be crazy hot. So you're not gonna be wearing the pants and the long sleeves. Even though it is off the shoulder, you can get away with it for summer, but pairing it with the shorts just really, really, really sends it home for a summertime look. Plus, I love the combo of this dusty mauve with the light wash. Now, to make it even more casual, I went with a nude sandal for these. So these are just some flat nude sandals with a little bit of rose gold detailing on them. And I just thought this look was very, very cute. So keep in mind that you can dress down a fancier, dressier cut by just pairing it with another more casual piece. So that is the three looks for the end of summer. And I hope you really, really liked these looks and I wanna see them if you recreate them. So be sure to uh, tag Curves, Girls, and Clothes on social media so that I can see them. And let me know in the comments if you're feeling these kind of videos that are more broad styling videos than just one brand because I get a lot of comments that you don't have they don't ship to your country or you don't have one close by when I talk about brands so I wanted to give you guys some more options of things that you can just put together yourself and let me know in the comments if you are feeling these style videos because I have quite a few ideas that I am going to be coming to you guys with and we are going to have everybody out in the streets looking bomb feeling bomb and putting outfits together themselves so thank you so much for watching and don't forget to subscribe